The much talked about the highly anticipated World Test Championship final eventually kicked off yesterday. But to just see the attention and the limelight that the India-England Test match got was so satisfying to see. It really does all go well for women's cricket. And what a Test match it turned out to be. England were in the driver's seat practically all through the Test match but India showing grit, resolve and sheer determination to save that test match and they did that quite comfortably towards the end. Plenty of highlights. If ever test match cricket and women's cricket needed an advertisement, this certainly was one. It was that kind of a, an exciting test match. Plenty of things to talk about. Kudos to the England team for playing the cricket that they did. They batted well in that first innings. Heather Knight led from the front. And well, the bowlers did really well to bundle India out in that first innings after that opening partnership. But it was all India after that in the second innings after being asked to follow on. Three highlights for me. We'll start with number one, the debutants. What a game it turned out to be for the folks who were wearing the whites of Team India for the first time. Snerana, Tanya Bhatia, Deepti Sharma and Shafali Varma. Each of them playing crucial roles in helping India save that game. Fascinating uh, from the youngsters, particularly Snerana and Tanya Bhatia towards the end in that long partnership that really, really did put England down into the ground. And at number two, I'm going to emphasize on one of those names, Shafali Varma. She isn't the next big thing in women's cricket. She is already the big thing in world cricket at 17 years of age. If that's the kind of strength that you possess, the shots that you can play and the confidence that you can display. We knew she was a dynamite in white ball cricket. But to show the kind of application that she did in the longest format of the game is a sign of things to come. Shafali Varma is a name that you will hear a lot more of in years to come. What a find for Team India. Fabulous knocks in both the innings. Rightfully, the player of the match in her debut game. What a start for a superstar in the making. And at uh, number three, well, I must just say that it was this Indian team. They've been under the scanner in the recent times. They haven't gotten the opportunities that they would have liked in terms of playing the amount of cricket that they want to. Uh, the South Africa tour to India didn't go as per plan. It was a horrid series for Team India and they really, really needed to come good. And they did. And in what fashion? It really sets them up well for the white ball series that is to follow. Everyone chipped in. Harman Kaur and Mithali Raj, the veterans of the team, couldn't contribute. But it really was the youngsters who came to the fore. And it uh, really is a good sign for an Indian team that is capable of lots. So as an Indian cricket fan, all we can do is give you all the support and encouragement because that's what this team needs. Go well Team India and looking forward to the White Ball Series.